stand at the threshold of a new era in space exploration, as everybody knows. Space may be vast, but as we seek to explore it, it is imperative that we not only seek out new destinations, but that we also enable safe and sustainable pathways to get there. I always enjoy coming to the Space Resources Week. I've been doing all of them, all the six of them. What I've really enjoyed about this year's Space Resources Week has been the really diverse mix of topics from business, from commercialization, startups through to the research, science, technology. I think it's been a really wonderful mix of all of the facets of our subject. It's been really great to see the trend of this conference over the past few years, going from something that's been more theoretical to something that's more, uh, you know, experimental and, and tangible. We had talks about power, about communications, uh, the legal aspects. Uh, unique this year was the, uh, uh, the meeting that they had at the same time from the United Nations Office of Outer Space Affairs, in which we got to learn from the group that is putting together a legal framework around space resources. So great combination of technical talks, legal aspects, and it was a very enjoyable meeting, like always. The community is vibrant, is growing, and the research is becoming more and more mature. This is, of course, the place to be in order to connect, to network, obviously, as well, to uh, see what's going on in other fields and in, in, in other places in the world and then to really, let's say, align, collect ideas, give ideas, develop ideas. Yeah, there's, there's been a really great opportunity here to interact with people that I've only ever seen on paper um, and actually um, talking to them in person and looking at how we can share our ideas. The most interesting thing is just better perspective on the industry, uh, where we sit uh, today with space resources, what the opportunities are in the future. Luxembourg is a perfect place to hold Space Resources Week. It is well known globally for its uh, activity in space resources uh, and it's been really, really a driving force for activity in Europe and worldwide as the home of space resources. I must admit I, it's, it's like a family. <laughs> I meet friends, I meet colleagues I know, but it's nice to see that there are lots of newcomers, in particular young people fresh from university with great ideas. The commitment within this community is vital in guiding those discussions and decisions that will shape the management of space resources and activities for the future.